racing away from the 1400 meter marker. Sail in the blue, final judgment. La Gitanella's on the outside. Caratage is now moving up into fourth. The secret is out, an army between the two of them. Then Gimme Six on the outside of that trip is goal with the black cab. Then we drop back to Dawn Calling, the high life is second to last. The back marker is a woman's way, 10 11 lengths off the leader. La Jatanella the leader, Caratage is on the outside, these two dispute the lead. Sails in the blue third, fourth position, final judgment. The secret is out, is near the rail. On the outside, Tanami, and then comes Trippy's girl. Gimme Six has given them about five or six lengths start. Then Dawn Calling on the outside of that one is the High Life, and a woman's way is the trailer. Bound to be homeward bound, larger Tanella the leader. Caratage second, Sale's going to go through down the inside. Final judgment, the Reds leaves and Cat now hooks out and gets the wake up. Towards the outside of that as the secret is out. Final judgment, Sale. On the outside, the secret is out. Down the inside, Gimme Six. Final judgment, Sale. Gimme Six runs on from behind. Dawn Calling's also trying to get into the race. Final judgment, Gimme Six on the inside. Gimme Six coming home strongly now. And Gimme Six won it. Final judgment, second. Sale, third. Dawn Calling ran fourth. Number eight, Gimme Six, the Gimme the Green Light, three-year-old Justin Snave. Anthony Del Pesce, number eight on the tote. It shows up 550 and two rand. Second goes to number four, Final Judgment. Third, number three, Sale. Fourth to Dawn Calling, number seven. Then A Woman's Way, the High Life is further back in the run. And they were followed by number nine, Trippy's Girl. The secret is out as further back, Elijah Tanella. They across the track and final judgment and sale are close together there. But the winner is on the two off the left, the blue sleeves and cap. And here comes the winner, Gimme Six. Gimme Six now records her third win from eight outings and she wins at well. Bred by Himmel and Arda Stud. Also Ken Truter and Madison Park. And this one is the victor, Anthony Del Pesh, back to the studio. Just seen the running of the Amzam Kulu Stakes, Grade 3 for 250,000 Rand, and Gimme 6 has come through with flying colours. And this is from the Justin Snaith team, another Gimme the Green Light. Love to have these progeny in the yard. Oh, very much so. He was a fantastic horse to train, and uh, funny enough, this became his unluckiest place was Gravel. I, I just couldn't get the starter to load him later, otherwise he would have won a Group 1 here. And it's just funny coming years later with him, uh, with his progeny, and... Uh, to be honest, this filly was just doing so well. Uh, you know, you bring a horse to Natal, some do well, some don't. And uh, this it was working. I said to Anthony, I know, you know, you, there's a cult that everyone's talking about, but you need to come try this filly out. And uh, he came and rode and he said, no, no, I'll definitely ride this. So uh, there was a bit of confidence, but obviously you've never been to Gravel. It's very hard for them. And uh, just really very happy. You know, Ken and Jane unfortunately couldn't make it up here. They tried to get flights and they couldn't make it. I'm just glad they can watch it from there. And obviously with Hassan involved with Give Me the Green Light and this filly, well done to everyone concerned. It's, uh, it's fantastic. They, they, ha they raced the mare together. They, Hassan had the father. So it's just really nice. It's, you know, it just makes it that little bit in, uh, more enjoyable. And to, to all the young jockeys, go watch Anthony on this horse. You want to see how to place a horse from a, from a bad draw? Go watch and learn. <laughs> well done. Great. Thank you very much. There's your winning memento from Greg Petzer. Thanks very much. And Justin Snaith, if you also want to receive on behalf of the owners there before Anthony Del Pesce steps in, well done to Hassan Adams and the Truters there. Winning trophies, well done to all Justin Snaith. Now, Justin, are just saying how to place a horse. Watch this replay. Yeah, it can go well for you when it works well. You're a hero. Well, I, I thought if I, I tried to go on the outside, I wasn't going to get caught wide. I just looked at the race. I said, my only way to get in is to miss it a little bit, and, and, and hopefully I slip on the inside and I, I get in a good position. And, and it worked out perfectly. I had sail, and I had uh, 
MJ in front of me. I had all the horses I had to beat was in front of me. And I thought if I couldn't make up three lengths, then I'm not good enough. But this, this horse has shown us such good work at home. And, and I said to Justin this morning, I said, if I was drawn in the first four, I'll tell you she'll definitely win. I said, anything that can beat me is the draw today. And, and she just shows you her work is, is as good as what, what she performed today. Well, you've brought home another progeny of Gimme the Green Light, Gimme Six, and she's knocked them for six, so well done. Yeah, I think they're going to have a lot of fun with her. I think she's going to win them a group one this season. She, she, she's got a lot of talent, this filly. From Greg Petzer there, well done to Anthony Del Pesh, receiving his winning memento, director of Gold Circle. Then let's get Lucky in. He's going to get his winning prize there, so well done to Lucky. He's the man who looks after Gimme Six. That's the running of the Amzam Kulu Stakes. Thanks very much to Greg Petzer. We've just seen number eight, Gimme Six, come through with flying colours.